Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ames and today we are watching School of Rock. I am so excited to watch this. I've never seen School of Rock. I haven't seen a lot of Jack Black's movies other than High Fidelity, Nacho Libre, and the new Jumanji's. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returner, thank you so much for being here. You know how much I love you and the film crew that is here on the channel. You guys rock. If you wanna be part of the film crew and get a happy dance, you gotta subscribe to get a happy dance. If you want to watch these full length reactions with me, you can head on over to my Patreon page. You can become a little Goomba like everybody else and watch along with us. We have such an amazing crew of Goombas over there. I thank everybody for any type of support they give on my channel. So thank you so much for being here. Let's get into this thing. Roll tape. You know what? I really don't know a lot about the history of rock. <laughs> I have bands and stuff I like, but I'm not really like a music history buff. Oh, that's cool. Paramount Pictures presents on the on the crew shirt there. That was really awesome. Oh, and all the posters. This is amazing. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I often, um, oh, Richard Linklater, I definitely sometimes match the energy of films. <laughs> the School of Rock. Oh, Joan Cusack's in this. Mike White, oh cool. He's the guy who did White Lotus, right? I really, really loved season two. Oh, Sarah Silverman. Okay, this is gonna be like a good, a good comedy. <laughs> he has a devilish smile, but it's so glorious. It's like such a wicked smile. It's so funny. <laughs> I wonder like how much of this is based on like the real Jack Black, like, how much he is a musician or not. I have no idea. <laughs> He's just such a goof. He just has such an amazing comedic style that is so amazing. These guys suck, leave. Oh, oh, he's gonna crowd surf. Yeah, there he goes. Oh no, <laughs> no one caught him, ow. That's gotta hurt. Nobody caught me, that was lame. Oh, Mike White did write this, cool. Amazing writer. He's amazing. He is a lazy freeloader and it's time for all this dysfunction to stop. Do you know how he gets in the morning? <laughs> Aren't you tired of letting people push you around? Yes. Oh, he's gonna kick him out. She's sick of having him as a roommate living in like the part of the living room. Dewey, it's the Dewey. first of the month and uh, I'd like your share of the rent now, please. <laughs> you wake me up for that? Come on. Oh. It's probably his best friend. Come on, stop breaking his balls. <laughs> I mean, you owe me a lot of money as it is. Yeah, try $2,200. The band is about to hit it big time. We're going to win Battle of the Bands, and when I'm rolling in the Benjamins, oh. I will throw you and your dog a bone. Oh, give it up. Your band has never made two cents. Patty, come on. I'm on this. <laughs> this was probably such a fun shoot for them with all these people cast in this. We can't talk about it later because Ned and I have to go to work. We have jobs. <laughs> I am an assistant to the mayor of the city. Hello. What? Can you get her out of here, please? Why? Why her? Yeah, why her? Dewey, a substitute teacher is not a temp. <laughs> I'd like to see you try. You wouldn't last one day. I serve a society by rocking. <laughs> rocking ain't no walk in the park, lady. Oh, baby. And if he doesn't come up with the rent by the end of the week, he's out of here. You should sell one of your guitars or something. <gasps> that is blasphemy. Would you tell Picasso to sell his guitars? <laughs> Idiot. No, he's got the passion for the music. It's never been a problem until she showed up. Just dump her, man. Come on! I may never have another girlfriend. The relationship always changes things with friends. I'm hungry and a minor Oh, no. They're gonna kick him out of the band, aren't they? They freaking better not. I'm gonna be pissed. I'm taking the Battle of the Band seriously this year. And Lucky in Kentucky? <laughs> You're fired. And your lyrics. Now, don't <gasps> take this the wrong way. Frickin' told you guys. Did you hear what I said? We voted. You're out. But he didn't get to vote, and he wasn't there. What's Spider. up, dog? No, this guy sucks. Well, this is my band. I brought us together. There's nothing I could do. Oh, shut up, man. You voted him out, too. I didn't tell you what to do. <laughs> I love all their 70s haircuts. It's amazing. You're trying to land a record deal here, man, and you're an embarrassment. Oh. Read between the lines, Theo. <laughs> You've been focused so hard on making it, forgot about one little thing. It's called the music. Oh, exactly. I'm gonna form my own band, and we are gonna start a revolution. 
be a funny little footnote on my epic ass. He's gonna do it for sure. <laughs> <laughs> He drop kicked the drum set. Oh, I hope he does it because he's right. And it's about the music. And like, he brought them together. How dare they kick him out? It's an SG mint condition. Oh, he is selling it. <gasps> no, Hendrix played this guitar. Hello? The silk robe he's wearing. He really has a whole vibe going on for himself. <laughs> yeah. Is this Mr. Schneebly? Nah, he's not here. Um, I'm the principal here at Horace Scream. Oh, no. Oh my God. But how is he gonna get paid if he's not like in the system, you know? But we do need somebody to start immediately. Mm-hmm, so how much are we talking here? <laughs> he's negotiating with her. Substitute, 650 a week. Excusez-moi. I think he's just coming in right now. Ned, phone! <laughs> Amazing. I have too many literal questions right now, but like how he would actually be able to do this. But I see the storyline moving on. He's gonna like form a band with his class for sure. And they're gonna win Battle of the Bands. He's gonna beat his old band. What a beautiful story. <laughs> Look at his prep outfit that he's wearing. <laughs> he cleans up real nice. Hey, able to Dewey Finn for tax reasons. We commenced at 815, school lets out at three. <laughs> you think I could cut out a little early today? I got some stuff I gotta do. This is considered the best elementary school in the state by adhering to a strict code of conduct, faculty included. You don't have to worry about me because I'm a hard ass. And I got no problem smacking them in the head. <laughs> okay, so just verbal abuse? No <laughs> verbal abuse. <laughs> Send them to me. I will do the disciplining. Check. Joan Cusack is a queen. I love her so much. She's so funny. Please take your seats. Ooh, very proper. Mr. Schneebly. Why don't you write your name on the board? <laughs> He doesn't even know how to spell his name. <laughs> Call me Mr. S. Mr. S. So I want you all to be on your best behavior. Who? Oh, AKA, be bad for the substitute teacher. All I need are minds for molding. I feel the laughter coming on already. Just the looks of Jack Black are so funny. You're not gonna get in, Travel. I'm hungry. You. What do you got? <laughs> Look at him walking in. Oh, it's got Sammy. He is gonna liberate this classroom. <laughs> Here's the deal. I've got a hangover. Doesn't that mean you're drunk? It means I was drunk yesterday. It means you're an alcoholic. <laughs> Wrong. Dude, you got a disease. <laughs> this kid. Freddie Jones, shut up. <laughs> shut up, Freddie Jones. You're such a prep. We'll start on this crapola tomorrow. Oh, she's gonna be keener. Oh, Tinkerbell. As class factotum, welcome to Horace Green. Oh. Any questions about her schedule? <gasps> keener. Miss Dumbum ain't your teacher today? I am. <laughs> Miss Dumbum. So I say, time for recess. That poster charts everyone's performance. We get gold stars when we master the material covered in class. Oh. What kind of a sick school is this? <laughs> All my gold stars. <laughs> as long as I'm here, that kid's loving there it. There will be no grades or gold stars. We're gonna have recess all the time. Woo! I'm in charge now. Okay. Summer should teach the class. It's all right, Emily. Oh. Don't cry. Just try to be oh, a no. bit more conscientious. Oh. <laughs> Would you like a hug? <gasps> I'll be good. I and don't hug me. They scare the living daylights out of me. Oh my gosh, these kids cast in this are just absolute cutie pies. Oh, he's counting on the clock. He doesn't want to be there. Some. Give me some. Give me some of that. Yeah. Woo -hoo! It's time to go play some music, baby. Dewey Finn wants you. The best rocking band ever auditions. That guy sucks, man. No, but he's so fun. Oh. He'll show you guys. Redemption, a story about redemption. Y yes, you can be in my band. I've got vision up the butt, so just go with it. <laughs> You're not a teacher, Ned. You're the cross-dressing, blood-sucking incubus from Magadeth. <laughs> Magadeth? Like sex god anymore. I'm a working stiff. She's got you brainwashed, man. I'm a working stiff. <laughs> Get a 
job. I got a job, okay? God, lighten up, lady. You got a job doing what? I do what Ned does. I'm tempted. Mike White with the writing in this. I'm just going to be cracking up this whole time. We split it 60-40. <gasps> grab your base and come back to the garage, brother. Yeah. I mean, don't you miss rocking out? Yes, he misses it. Come on. I don't want to be in a band with you. You're more delusional than I thought. Oh, get out of here. Maybe it's time to give up those dreams. Never. Never give up on your dreams, people. These are going really great for me. <sighs> Whatever. You have a girlfriend. Big whoop. You don't have any fun with, with the boys. <laughs> Your friends are also your soulmates. Come on. Maybe she'll have a change of heart once she sees how much fun he's having, you know? Just do whatever you want. <laughs> My parents don't spend $15,000 a year for recess. Teach them about music. Here's a useful lesson for you. Give up. Just quit. Because in this life, you can't win. Because the world is run by the man. The man. <laughs> And there used to be a way to stick it to the man. It was called rock and roll. <laughs> now he's teaching them. Doing that too with a little thing called MTV. Because the man's just going to call you a fat, washed up loser and crush your soul. <laughs> now that's a speech. On Tuesdays, the children have music class. Perfect timing. Here with our lecture on the man when we return. Can you be the music teacher? Hello? Oh no, he's like, who is this god awful teacher teaching music class? Oh, he'd be such a great music teacher. My heart is exploding watching this. I'm just so excited for it tenfold. Oh no. <laughs> Freddy. Oh, the clarinet. Of course, Summer plays the clarinet. So rigid. There's no freedom in this. They need to rock. <laughs> he can't believe what he's seeing. Oh, he's bringing in everything to the classroom. <laughs> His physical comedy is unbelievable. It's like him, Jim Carrey, Ryan Gosling. I'm sure there's more, but like adds so much more to his comedy performances. Why didn't anyone tell me? You play the guitar? Yeah. Okay, come here. We're forming a band. You play the electric guitar? My dad won't let me. Seems to waste of time. Oh no. Oh, I like the eight balls on that. play by ear? I played a lot of Guitar Hero. <laughs> if I spent as much time on a real guitar, I could probably play the guitar by now. Okay, I know a lot of rock songs, but these are all like classics. Yes. <laughs> Piano man, front and center. Piano man. <laughs> Give this a try on my count, all right? The doors. Yes. It's gonna be the best freaking band ever. Lawrence is good at piano. <laughs> Stop. That's perfect. You're perfect. Stay right there. Bless these children. Bless these children. Hey, what was that thing you were playing today? The big thing? Cello. <laughs> you tip it on the side. Cello. You've got a bass. Love bass. Love the bass. But let your fingers do the rock and keep that G coming all day long. Any drummers in the house? <laughs> we got Freddie on. Percussion. Exactly. Maybe he'll learn and get good at the drums. Rock on, Freddie. Freddie is gonna be so perfect on the drums. I can't wait for him to learn and get better. Okay, that's really good. Freaking natural. With the fifth above it and the, the middle one. No middle one. I changed my mind. I love this. <laughs> yes. Good. Okay. No, that's bad. That's like George of the Jungle. These kids freaking rock. Oh no, but are they gonna be too loud? And headmistress is gonna come in? <laughs> of course I believe in grades. I was testing you and you passed. Good work, Summer. Four and a half gold stars for you. <laughs> I think it's time we started our new class project. A science project? <laughs> rock band. Rock band! I believe in science. 
Will other schools be competing? Oh, yes. That every school in the state will be competing for the top prize. What's the prize? <laughs> Win will go on your permanent record. Hello, Harvard, yo. Ooh, don't trick them, though. <laughs> But if anyone finds out what we're doing in here, we'll be disqualified. So let's just keep it on the down low. Oh, no. Are the parents going to have brain aneurysms? They're going to be like, what the F have you been doing in this school this year? <laughs> just because you're not in the band doesn't mean you're not in the band. We need backup singers who can sing. The sun will come out yes. tomorrow. You've got it. And I don't even know what it is, <laughs> but you've got it. <laughs> Amazing grace. What an angel. Eat the sound. My God. Before I start crying, you're in the band. <laughs> I can sing. Uh-oh, Summer, can you? All right, Summer, belt it. Memory all alone in the moonlight. Pretty good. All right. <laughs> don't crush her soul. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I love them. I don't think I should be in the band. I'm not cool enough. Yeah, you are. Nobody ever talks to me. Well, those days are over, buddy. <laughs> if you're in a rockin' band, you're the cat's pajamas, man. Welcome to my world. Oh, he's gonna be such a good mentor for him and like help him build confidence. Get past the people that are such bullies and naysayers. Slap it, shoot it, kaboot it. <laughs> That's an awesome handshake. Where has this movie been my whole life? <laughs> Lead guitar, Zack Attack. Take a seat. Zack Attack. Oh, I'm gonna love all these nicknames. Mr. Cool, Bazzy McGee. Blondie, brace face. <laughs> brace face. <laughs> Fancy pants, get over here. You guys oh are on gosh. security detail. Oh. What we're doing in here, the future of the band depends on you. First mission, soundproofing this room. He's gonna get into so much trouble. Instead? Of course you can, Fancy Pants. Oh. Without a first-rate roadie crew, we'll never have a psychedelic show. And I can't live with that. <laughs> Groupies. <laughs> Groupies, perfect. It's so perfect. Summer's gonna be so good at this. She's gonna totally own it. Naming the band. <gasps> oh. <laughs> These girls are adorable. Wait, isn't this a student project? Are you supposed to be in the band? Good questions. Well, teachers like to play too. And not only am I gonna play, I'm El Capitano. Put your hands over your hearts. Make him swear. <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the band of Mr. Schneebly. <laughs> and we'll defer to him on all issues related to the musical direction of the band. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Let's get rocking! Yeah! <laughs> Ooh. Morning, Summer. Groupie. She learned what it meant. I research groupies on the internet. They're sluts. They sleep with a band. But I made a special position just for you. What is it? Band manager. Oh, she's gonna love that. Summer, you're in charge of everything. She'll settle for that because she'll have control. <laughs> she's gonna get them on a really good schedule. A schedule of winning. Uh, let's see, Tamika. Okay, we're all here. Look. <laughs> When you start a band, is talk about your influences. Okay, so who do you like? Be like all pop stuff. Christina Aguilera. Who? No. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Puff Daddy. Wrong. <laughs> Liza Minnelli. Oh. Project is called Rock Band. I'm talking about bands that rock. Led Zeppelin. <laughs> They're like who? What? I don't know, know any of those rock bands. Don't tell me you guys have never gotten the lead out. What about Sabbath? ACDC. Motorhead. Lemmy, baby. New schedule. 8.15 to 10. Rock history. Freight faster summer. <laughs> How are we being graded in all this? If you grade Grub one more time, I will send you back to the first grade. You got it? I wonder how much he cracked these kids. How much they giggled. We have awesome material, which I wrote. Let's hear it. Mm, oh, oh, oh. Let's hear your song. Yeah, boy. And uh, it's not done yet. And you might not like- play a song, Schneebly. <laughs> Calling it like it is, boys. Oh no, they're gonna hate it. The tip of the tongue, the teeth and the lips. The top of the tongue, the teeth, the lips. I do that warm up for acting all the time. A dark stage and then a 
beam of light. He's more of a visionary, I think. There was a man who knew the road. Oh, yeah, because he's really good at his storytelling, right? With songs. Seem to understand chimes, Freddy. Of the rent was way past due. And then, Katie, you come in with the bass. Slapping the bass, man. Without me, but you're mine! Oh, I see. I see the story he's telling now. What a monologue. <laughs> what a music monologue. With the backup singers would be like, well, you're not hardcore. No, you're not hardcore unless you live hardcore. You're not hardcore unless you live hardcore. Boom! Big old explosion. I thought it was really catchy. Oh, you suck up. We came up with some names for the band. Yeah, hit me. The Bumblebees? No. How about Pig Rectum? Shame show. It's a science project. Organizing a field trip for the kids at the end of the month. What do you think about that? Substitutes, as a rule, do not organize field trips. How about everyone in magenta? Don't blow it, Billy. I, I say no testing. The children are the future. You can teach them well, but... Oh my God, you're doing Whitney Houston. Let the children's laughter just remind us how we used to be. He's just using the lyrics for the Whitney Houston song. Isn't that a song? No. Uh... <laughs> oh, they're gonna have to write a new song. This one's not gonna cut it. Freddie, that was awesome. You're rocking, but it's a little sloppy Joe. <laughs> Lucy Goosey, baby. Loosey goosey. Get loose with it, buddy. But the thing is, rock is about the passion, man. Where's the joy? I'm counting on you for some style, brother. Power stance. You own the universe. You own the universe. <laughs> this is so good. Not saying like prep school kids are like rigid and uptight, but like, you know, it usually has more rules and more pressures. So it's really cool to see them doing something like music and music class. And a teacher like him to be able to help free them and let loose and it be more expressive of themselves. Your homework is to listen to some real music. Get inspired. Oh, CDs. It will blow the classical music out your butt. <laughs> <laughs> Neil Pert, one of the great drummers of all time, study Ooh. up. Uh, we're not goofing off. We're creating musical fusion. Get used to it. Freddie loves it. Are you psyched about the new project? Sure. Oh going on with him? Are you having like trouble at home or something or? I don't want to be a roadie. Maybe she's a good singer. I want to be a singer. Oh my gosh, she probably has an amazing voice. Okay, sing me something. But maybe she's really, really shy. Come on girl, you can do this. I'll let you be a singer if you can't sing. You told me to leave you alone. I said come on home. She needs to be the lead singer. Take it. Burn your love and he's much too strong. Oh. Chin, chin, chin. Oh my God, good Lord. Nice pipes, Tamika. Why didn't you raise your hand when I was looking for singers? I have a tear in my eye from hearing this absolute angel. What a talent. What a freaking talent. Imagine I wish I had a voice like that. What a sweetheart. I love her. I hope she becomes the lead vocalist and takes over his spot and they will for sure win. <laughs> no offense, Jack Black. Love you. Look at all their berets. <laughs> Zach, Zach, do not walk away from me. Ugh, blah. I knew something was going on at home. No more rock music, okay? <gasps> yeah, I got in trouble. Mother effer. Oh, because I think he loves music so much and his dad is saying no. Gotta do your chores. Blah. Boring. The man always telling you how to live your life. Who can tell me what it's really about? Scoring chicks? No. no. Getting wasted. No. <laughs> Come on. No. Sticking it to the man? Yes. You gotta get mad at the man. And right now I'm the man. Yeah. Who's gonna tell me off? Shut the hell up, Schneebly. Yes, Freddy. Get out of here, stupid ass. <laughs> yes, Alicia. You're a fat loser and you have body odor. <laughs> he was like, that was too real. You're tacky and I hate you. Okay, you see me after class. <laughs> I didn't get no allowance today, so now I'm really ticked off. I didn't get my allowance. Because I am really ticked off. 
<laughs> if someone was pushing you around, telling you what to do, what would you say? Step off. Step I'd tell him to step off. Dad, step off. <laughs> All right, Billy's feeling it a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> the kids are loving it. <laughs> I can't wait for Tamika to just have her freaking solo. And those that can't teach, teach gym. Am I right? <laughs> oh, yeah, like, he cracked them. <laughs> I'm just joshing. <laughs> I'm just joshing. Oh, man. I used to say that all the time as a kid. Say, that was a really cool lesson today. Well, thanks, dude. <gasps> All the rest of the teachers, they are all so impressed. Oh shit, they're gonna be so mad when they find out what he's been doing, but maybe not. They're gonna be like, wow, we're inspired to not be so rigid in our teaching. <laughs> Ooh, oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh yes, they're doing some choreography. Can't imagine the parents and how mad the parents are gonna be when they find out what's been going on all year but how much fun for these kids. They just get to be so expressive and they just get to be so themselves. Oh, th the business of music, wow. Oh, he's practicing in his room. There's nothing like expressing yourself. Music is so amazing for that. It just brings out so much in people. It says a lot too, right? To also have fun have fun in learning. I felt like my school was so boring and I should have gone to some sort of like art school because I just found it to be so dry. Ugh, get me out of here. And what oh. have you done to your hair? It's called punk. Well, it's... <laughs> Miss Mullins, you're the man. Thank you, Frankie. <laughs> it's coming up and I do expect everyone to have a presentation. <gasps> oh man, dealing with parents must be hell. No offense to all those parents out there but I've heard some stories. Is, uh, is she always like that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> and she got drunk at the alumni dinner. And did a Stevie Nicks impersonation. Oh, maybe she's repressed and he's gonna open everybody up and liberate the whole school. She's probably sick of having this persona. Security detail? Oh no, is he sneaking everybody out of school to go on a field trip? Uh oh, he's gonna get in big, big trouble if he gets caught. Oh my God, he's putting him in the, them in the van. <laughs> no seatbelts. Parents would consider this like kidnapping, so. Blue. Blue, that's right. Are they playing a tape of him? And Marco. But then these kids didn't get to go to the show. He has a full on operation going on here. Oh, check out these old kids, man. Oh, are they going to tryouts? I thought this was a uh, battle of the bands, not the uh, Mickey Mouse Club. Hey, you want a piece of me? I don't think I can sing. Come on, girl. You can do it. I don't feel good. I feel sick. Because you're so nervous. Oh, man, I feel you. I get nervous, too. They're going to laugh at me. No, never. No one ever will laugh at you ever because you have a voice of an angel. <gasps> Poor thing. She's worried about her body image. You heard of Aretha Franklin, right? Okay, she's a big lady. Everybody wants to party with Aretha! You know who else has a weight <laughs> issue? Me. Me. Yeah. Start doing my thing. People worship me! Because I'm sexy! What an inspo. You're a rock star now. All you gotta do, you just gotta go out there, just rock your heart out. You're gonna get your, sign your own contract because you're a star. I just love what he's doing for these kids. It's so amazing. What? Where? Some guys invited him out to their van. What? Oh no. Is he smoking pot? <laughs> Freddie Jones, you get out of that band this instant. He's the rebel in the band. He looks up to you, and you are setting an example for him. So quit messing around and start acting like a responsible adult. That goes for all okay. of you guys. Don't make me come back here. <laughs> you had me worried sick, man. Rock ain't about it getting loaded and acting like a jerk. One great rock show can change the world. It's a very important lesson he's teaching him. I will send a note home to your parents. Let's go. <sighs> it's a great threat. Sorry, the bill's full. We're already overbooked. No, no, no. Let no. us just play one song. Kids? What is it, some kind of gimmick? No. God. These kids have worked their little fingers to the bone just to play one song for you, so you just sit down, shut up, and listen. <laughs> Oh my God, they're kids. Come on, one more. God, what a disappointment. And we shouldn't take no for an answer. Would you just listen to me? Yeah, she's the band manager. Listen to her. 
And it wasn't fair to the kids, especially after everything they'd been through. Summer, what? I volunteer down at uh, St. Margarita's in the children's wing. <laughs> He's gonna guilt trip them to let them play. I told the kids if they practiced, they'd get into Battle of the Bands. They're terminal. It's because they're dying. What a bad, what a bad thing to do. <laughs> oh, they're pretending to be sick. <laughs> Oh what they do before they bit the dust was play Battle of the Bands. What do they all have? It's a rare blood disease. Stick it to the mon neosis. <laughs> What's that? I never heard of it. You're lucky. Because it's hell. It's too good. Stick it to the man. <laughs> Freddy's like dead on the ground. Summer with the wind. <laughs> Oh, they didn't even have to audition. He just let them in. They're all vibing because they got into Battle of the Bands. Did they come up with a name yet? School of Rock. The School of Rock. I love it. Oh, I'm gonna cry. We have a red alert, it's Mullins. Let's go. Oh my gosh, positions everybody. <laughs> positions everybody. Oh, quick change here. What's he gonna do for the presentation though? E equals MC squared. Oh, Miss Mullins, come in. Some Einstein stuff. But Miss Lemon said she heard music coming from the classroom. What, how, when, where? Miss Lemons must be on crack, right kids? <laughs> Throwing her under the bus. <gasps> Somebody didn't put the guitar away. We were learning in sing song. Continue with your method. What a ball buster. What is he gonna do? He's gonna get, he's gonna enlist Summer to help him. He's good at improv. He's gonna be able to pull it off, I think. It is a wonderful thing. Get off your atlas to the mat. <laughs> Three minus four is negative one. Six times a billion is... Six billion? Nailed it! No, it's nine! <laughs> yes, I was testing you! It's nine! And that's a magic number. I find your methods of teaching very unusual. Did study with Dr. Errol von Strassenberger. Who? Oh, you don't know him? Do you think maybe we could grab some coffee? You wanna go get some coffee with me? Oh, she must be so lonely. Maybe she doesn't have any friends. Coffee, AKA beer? Gonna get her drunk. In your experience, how does Horace Green compare to the other schools that you've taught at? Your school's the best. Open her up, see what she's really like. Stay right there, I'm gonna go put on some music. Oh, he's gonna put on Fleetwood Mac? It's like she's never drank a beer before in her life. <laughs> she probably doesn't have any friends and she's probably lonely and she's probably just like living this persona. And so I'm I'm excited for her to get some friends. Oh, he, yeah, he did. He did put on Fleetwood Mac. I love this song. Reminds you of how you used to be probably. Oh man, I would love to take the kids to a concert. Would it be educational? Indeed, it will be educational. Oh, but you kind of got her drinking and she's probably not going to remember what she said. I feel like all day today, I'm just going to be turning everything I say into song. <laughs> you know, this is the first time any teacher has ever asked me to do anything outside of school. People are a little intimidated. Intimidated? They hate me. There was a time when I was yeah. fun. That's what I said. But you can't be funny. Principal of a prep school. These parents will come down on me like a nuclear bomb. They they probably will, so I feel I feel you. I know, you need to be liberated as well. I can't wait for you to be liberated. I think you're pretty cool. Yeah, you just need to be more yourself. We all need to be more ourselves. That's what's cool in life, is when you're just yourself. <gasps> uh. <laughs> Billy, it's just not the right style. Style? You're gonna talk to me about style? <laughs> You can just wear their uniforms. Yeah, because it's a school of rock. 
put a little bit of flair on their uniforms. <laughs> what are you playing? Just something I wrote. <gasps> Let's hear it. Maybe we were making straight A's. We were stuck in a dumb days. I love it. You wrote that. Okay, that's it. You guys rock and roll positions. Sweet little Billy writing songs in his bedroom for for the band. Gonna win them at Battle of the Bands. You know what'd be better? If it was rock got no reason, rock got no rhyme. And also, we need some ooh la la. So like ooh la la la. <laughs> so much fun. I'm loving this. <laughs> now you've played hard in here, people. And I am proud of every last stinking one of you. Oh, you bet you are. We may fall on our faces with a guitar in our hands and rock in our hearts. <laughs> we roll tonight to the guitar bite. And for those about to rock, I salute you. <laughs> Passion in his salute is just so amazing. Talk about our little field trip tomorrow. What field trip? Told you she wasn't gonna remember. It's a little stressed out because it's parents' night tonight. All gonna be fine. Until they meet you. But he's really good at schmoozing and like getting in there and making everyone feel comfortable. So maybe he's gonna be really good at this. I got a check from Horace Green Prep for $1,200. Oh no. What's going on? Dewey? Oh, he's gonna kick him out for sure. <laughs> and I said I was you just to make some money, but then I got there and the kids they rock, man. And now we're playing tomorrow Battle of the Bands. Oh no, Ned is not gonna be happy with this. We'll come clean. I'll tell everyone it was my fault. He had nothing to do with it. You'll be fine. Ned, huh? Don't say anything to her. <sighs> She's gonna be able to read his face. Oh no. Ned, don't come clean. What's going on, Ned? Oh no, she can't ruin it. She can't ruin everything. And Ned, keep your wits about you, man. It's your bestie. Probably not a great situation for Ned though. He's like, damn it. But it's not his fault. I'm not a teacher. A substitute is a teacher. <laughs> Those parents are gonna love you. <laughs> that dad is horrified. He's like, who is this man? All my son can talk about is music. He says when he grows up, he wants to be a musician. There's such a thing as teacher student confidentiality. <laughs> Expect us to believe this garbage? Well, what's a project, Summer? It's prestigious. Oh, fudge. They're screwed. The kids are gonna bail them out though, I think. They're just all really cool kids. And if they were mine, I would be so proud. And I am proud just to even know them. Apparently that man is not Ned Schneebly. Yeah, he's not even a teacher. You called the cops? She did, she got it out of me. My name is Dewey Finn, and no, I'm not a licensed teacher, but I have been touched by your kids. And I'm pretty sure I've touched them. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. That's not, that's not what you say, that's bad. Even Summer's like, uh-oh. They're all gonna like freak out. <laughs> they just bolted out of there so fast. Did he not get arrested? Oh. Yeah, I told you to be like Ned, Dewey. I didn't tell you to be Ned. Oh, you shut up, shut up. Yeah, it'd be so annoying having to deal with them. You really stood up there, Ned. Way to go, buddy. You can't understand. It was easy for you to give up music. It ain't easy for me. It wasn't easy for me. I couldn't keep kidding myself anymore. Gotta follow the rules of society. Get a real job. I think it's time you moved out. But isn't it his apartment? <laughs> He's like, all right, fine, I'll go become a music teacher and I'll actually get a real job. He just wanted us to play a show so we can make some money. It was not a waste of time. And you're an idiot. Hey, shut up. No, you shut up. Hey, you want to go? Confidence. Touch him, I'll shove those sticks down your throat. Got it? <gasps> I say we get out of here and play the damn show. <laughs> Children be exposed to this imposter, this maniac. Oh, no, she's going to hear it from them now. She's going to crack. Okay, we're all here for the field trip. Where's Mr. Schneebly? We need to go pick him up. Come on. Taking orders from a kid. <laughs> She's so convincing that little summer. I love her so much. <laughs> what you got now? <laughs> oh. <laughs> we did what you told us. We stuck it to the man. <laughs> we're on a mission. One great rock show can change the world. Yes. I hope he's not naked. Okay, he's got boxers on. 
Get down here, let's go. That is so punk rock. Yeah, it is. They busted out of school. One great rock show can change the world. She's so good in this role. She's making me so mad at her. We've got some rocking to do. We're gonna call the school. Stick up for him, Ned. Let's rock! I'm sorry that I used you guys. Aw. Come on, we're gonna be late. There's no time for apologies. <laughs> that was nice of him to apologize, though. I really like that. I don't wanna miss this, Patty. Unbelievable. When are you gonna stop being a pushover? Break up with her. There it is in your face, Patty. What a mood killer. But she's so good in this role. She's making me so angry. Ugh, it's killing the vibe, man. All of your children are missing. So let's all go to the show and watch them rock out. They'll see it will open their eyes to see how amazing their kids are. If they couldn't already see that already. Yeah, we're competing. We're the school of rock. <laughs> nice, pushing the story along real quick there. <laughs> Ooh, is this the old band? You don't have to listen to those hacks. Come on, band meeting. <laughs> so I think we should play Zach's. Yes. Your song rocks harder, so let's play it. Yes. We came here to play one great show, and on Zach's song, you guys really rock. Yes. God of rock, thank you for this chance to kick ass. <laughs> now let's get out there and melt some faces! Accuser to the other song. I, I love you, buddy. Improvising, you know the song, I know you can do it! Yes, make it your own. What's this? You wanted to go with a uniform, so put it on. <gasps> Look at that outfit. Did he get a haircut? Not bad, not bad. No, oh, slow down, old man. Some lunatic has kidnapped our kids. He didn't kidnap them, they kidnapped him. <laughs> All right, let's get tickets. I love Joan Cusack's like anxiety that she's able to portray. She does it in such an amazing way. We're the school of rock. Ooh, can't wait for the parents to have the realization. <laughs> Look at their outfits. All the inspo that they've gotten from all the bands and all the music. Oh, it's so adorable. He's so punk rock. <laughs> <laughs> He's wearing shorts. I love it so much. You feel the passion. Here's a solo. <laughs> <laughs> Ned had a good laugh. This would have been so much fun to make this movie. These kids must have had so much fun with Jack Black and the whole crew, everything. Oh my gosh. Oh, the dry ice. Here we go. Oh, Mr. Cool. <laughs> Ten-year-old superstar. Oh, the dads. <laughs> Yeah, he got caught! Yes! <laughs> He's finally crowd surfing. <laughs> oh, nice. They put on such an awesome rock show. And look at the, the groupies. The groupies were so good. We were so good. <laughs> He's like, that's all that matters is that you loved the show. I don't care how much trouble I'm going to get into or I am in. Who's right. the manager? I am. Summer Hathaway. Oh. Nice to meet you. I'd love to see her in the future. That's rock, dude. How old are you? Ten. I used to play classical, but now I play rock. Hey, nice. Band. Ooh. Principal of a school. S says sex on him. He's coming on hot. So hot. What? Huh? I'm sorry. Oh, he has a thing for principals. The winner of this year's Battle of the Bands competition. Who gets to choose? There's no vacancy! Oh, boo. Boo! No! What? Oh, is the crowd gonna reverse it? Boo! Give it to the kids! Don't let the man get you down. Oh, it's like reverse. They're cheering him up now and motivating him. It was unbelievable, wasn't it? Yeah. Completely changing his mindset. Encore! 
parents have quickly changed their tune. Wait, my kids were kidnapped. Now we're happy. It's an encore. They want us to go play another song. It's good. Go, you guys. It can be his song. Oh, no, they're going to play a classic here. Nice. They gonna offer him a job? Here's that talk to the band, I'll get back to you. <gasps> You're so desperate, then quit lowballing us. After school program, School of Rock. Rock 101 Advanced Rock. He started his own program after school. In his apartment. I love it. <gasps> He's teaching. Music. He got back into music. Look at these little babies. How much fun would this be if you were a 10 year old kid? I think it would still be fun and I'm an adult. Wonder if all these kids can actually play all these instruments. It seems like they can. <laughs> Everyone's getting their own solo. <laughs> he rocked too hard. <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> so I'm like, what the frick? Oh, Bogart the Mike, Alicia, that was beautiful. <laughs> Bogart the Mike. <laughs> that was tasty. That was tasty. Oh God, she's so good. His riffs and scats are so freaking funny. I just can't. Take five. You want to go? All right. That was a good class. No, I'll see you, man. What an epic way to end the movie. What a brilliant way to roll the credits. I love that and to stay for all the credits. You guys, that was School of Rock. I am so happy because what rock have I been living under? Just never seen this movie. You know, it's probably too busy rewatching Ace Ventura and Wayne's World a million times because those are some of my movies that I absolutely love and adore, and probably Zoolander. So those are a lot of the comedies that I watched. But this was such an epic, feel good movie. I love the themes of this movie. You know, never give up on your dreams. You know, do things even if you're not good at them. Keep going if you love it. It's such a great story. Thank you so much for being here. If you love movies, don't forget to hit that sub. I really appreciate it. it, means a lot to me. Hit the like, and I'll see you guys in the next reaction video. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Woo! Ciao. <laughs>